2020 cricket will be held for the second time at the Asian Games when the event begins on Saturday. It's led to host South Korea forming a team for the first time in their history. And as Paul Rees reports from Incheon, their players already have the skills to make the transition to the new game. Baseball is king in South Korea, but for a few weeks at least, there's a new sport in town. Cricket is being held at the Asian Games in Incheon, and as hosts, the Koreans are putting out a team. Most of them had never played cricket until a year ago. But their college baseball careers mean they're more than handy with bat and ball. Cho Sung-hoon has been labelled the Korean Sachin Tendulkar by teammates. He hit a 50 in their final warm-up match. I never expected to play cricket because I had never heard of it. But representing my country is a great opportunity. One thing baseball couldn't prepare the team for is bowling spin. Fortunately, they've had lifelong training in the use of chopsticks. Yeah, I think the chopstick techniques um, incorporates a lot of the spin technique as well. Because I, when you use chopstick, you use every single finger. So you have control on your finger basically by using chopsticks. There was food for thought as South Korea prepared for their competitive 2020 debut at Incheon 2014, but still a big victory over the best players from the expat league. Now, while the creation of a cricket team has so far had only a small impact on Korean sport, the man coaching these players believes skills learned from baseball could be key to cricket's future. Former county cricketer Julian Fountain also played baseball for Great Britain's Olympic team. He's been in the coaching setups with the West Indies, Bangladesh and England and was the fielding coach for Pakistan's test side until last year. Cricket and baseball come from the same parent many, many years ago. So it's sort of it's an evolutionary process that cricket has come back around and the skills required to be a good T20 or an elite T20 player are very similar to baseball. Obviously, we've got very high hopes for our team, but some of my guys have only really been playing cricket for a year. Um, so if we come up against teams such as Sri Lanka or Bangladesh who've been playing for their entire life, it's a big, big hill to climb. A meeting with Sri Lanka could await if South Korea get to the quarter-finals. The gloves will be off for their first group match against Malaysia. Paul Rees, Al Jazeera, Incheon, South Korea.